Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily, daily vibes for Sunday, March 18th. Let me get this zoomed right in. Oh, that light. That's sunlight from my window. So it appears to me that there's something new and exciting coming to you because of your faith, because of your belief. Somebody has um, is receiving something. They're receiving something because of their strong beliefs it could now this could be belief in themselves okay somebody has a lot of faith they have really worked on spiritual growth and manifesting okay and now it looks like something is coming very quickly in their direction okay it's something they've been waiting for somebody's patience has paid off their faith their um their manifestation okay somebody has manifested something you know through their beliefs and because they have done that now what they've been manifesting and waiting for is coming in probably very quickly okay so it, it, you know and it's after a period of not receiving and feeling down like when was this dream going to happen? You know, there's been a, a, a lack of uh, a dream fulfillment, okay? That's what this is. It's like there's been, it, it hasn't been coming. It hasn't been coming, but you kept the faith. You kept the faith and you kept believing and you kept manifesting. And because you have done that, there is some sort of new growth, okay? It's grown. There's been, the seed was planted a long time ago and your faith and your belief has has watered and nurtured and uh, allowed this to come to fruition. And I feel like today or tomorrow, because timing is fluid, um, it's happening, okay? You should be feeling abundant. You should be feeling um, like you're receiving some sort of reward. Okay, I feel like you're receiving some sort of your re reward for your faith, you know? It's like you've, you've been listening. You've been listening and you've been allowing. Allowing things to happen as they should and believing in yourself, believing in your path, believing in your abilities. And because you've done that, it, it looks like you, you, I mean, you could be even receiving some communication today. There could be some communication that's coming in that makes you feel very, very abundant, okay? And it's exciting communication. Now, this could be from a new partner, a new perspective partner, or something, anything that's new and exciting that you have, you've manifested this, so you know what it is. That's what I'm telling you. It's like you know exactly what this is because this is your inner knowing. This is your inner guide as well. You guys have manifested some sort of dream, Okay, and you have you have done the work to make it happen. And that's what's going on here, you know. And I, you could absolutely be receiving some sort of communication today that is 
allows you or makes you feel very good okay there's a really good feeling of of contentment here yeah but then again you had to, that's what it is you had to leave something behind to get there yes you did you did have to leave something behind you had to walk away from something and I think that many of you have done this you have let go of something and this could be something that you were emotionally attached to but it feels like you did the work to let it go and you released it because it just didn't serve you anymore it was like it was too many burdens and I think that you have let go of some burdens uh, honestly you honestly let go of some burdens and now your ships are coming in and I think they're they're coming in very quickly I do I feel like you guys have really used your inner self your inner abilities your oh what's the word for it You've set the intentions for this new growth, okay? You've planted the seeds, and I know this is hard to understand, but it's like you guys set the intentions, you let go of something that didn't emotionally serve you, you walked away from it, and because you have walked away for or you are walking away from it, this could go several ways. This, is tell, this could be telling somebody to drop these burdens. Okay, drop these burdens. Let go of something that doesn't that isn't love, okay, that isn't fulfilling your wishes, and leave it, okay, just walk away from it, it can go that way, some of you have already done this, and because you have believed in yourself and followed your own path, your ship is coming in, so there's different stages for different people, some people are just being called to follow, listen to themselves, listen to their inner guys, guys, listen to your inner guide, I mean, that's what that hierophant is, believe in yourself, listen to your inner guide, drop the burdens, drop these, uh, this baggage that you're carrying around, and once you drop this baggage and truly leave it behind, your ships will come in, and they will come in very quickly, and it will be very, very exciting, okay, this is a new partnership, the Ace of Wands, this is new growth, new fertility, new excitement. I mean, there is this is could even this is a new partner, okay? And it's a very exciting new partner that leads to a permanent commitment, okay? It leads to permanence, okay, with the ten of pentacles. So whatever is happening, you know, is leading to a permanent commitment and it's because you have done the work to shed something that doesn't serve you. You've believed in yourself, you've followed your own path, you've trusted yourself, you know, and when you can trust yourself, it's the ultimate gift, okay? And when you when you can give that to yourself, the universe reacts, and that's what I think is happening here. You guys had to leave something. You guys had to leave some sort of relationship. You had to let a dream die. You had to let a a dream or you know and that's what this is the ten of cups it's like a dying dream something had to end I mean that's what these two cards mean it was it was you know it wasn't meant to be and I think that many of you have come to some realization that it wasn't meant to be it isn't meant to be and I need to not look back because you were feeling left out in the cold, you were feeling alone, you know, a disappointment. I think that, you know, with disappointment brings growth. And that's what's happened here because there's been a lot of growth. Somebody has had a lot of growth through a time of adversity, per se. And now they're getting what they deserve. You know, I think there was a period of anger, discontent, chaos. You know, there has been. But I think that somebody has grown out of that state of mind. They have. I feel like they are starting to, things are starting to turn in their favor after a period of lost concentration, loss of focus, loss of feeling loved, and now they have come to the conclusion that that desire or that dream or is no longer feasible and I think they have manifested a new one okay I think they've manifested a new permanent 
relationship, a new permanent partner, a new a new permanence that is exactly what they deserve because they have done their work, you know, you 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 get what you give. So somebody has put a lot of work into themselves, a lot of work into believing in themselves, a lot of work into releasing this relationship and this could be a relationship with any person but the ten of cups is a relationship they have released a relationship that didn't work out and because they have done the work they are now receiving you know they have grown something new they are now receiving a new opportunity that's very excitement I mean very exciting very um, fertile okay and I think it's happening very quickly I think that somebody has been patient and what they've been wishing for is coming and it is leads to something permanent. There's been a lot of heartache, okay? And maybe now somebody, you know, with suffering brings true growth. And that's the three of swords. And the three, that's the meaning of this card. Suffer, this is, somebody has been suffering and growing at the same time and that is exactly what this reading is your suffering has been teaching you things with the hair of fun about yourself it's been teaching you what you want what you don't want what you're worth you know many of you have gone through uh, You've been deepening your spiritual practice through this suffering, okay? You've had to search. You've had to soul search, okay? And with soul searching comes enlightenment. So I feel like many of you have are letting go of the past freely, believing in yourself and receiving a reward, something that you deserve. And it leads to permanent. It leads to something very permanent. It's a permanent foundation here. Um, something has taught you true growth. That's what I see. And you're receiving a, a reward. Let me get one of these. Which one? I want an oracle, but I'm not sure what I want. Somebody has realized, because this is also realization, somebody has realized that these old dreams are no longer suitable, okay? With the hair of and these are the old dreams that are reversed. Somebody has realized that these old dreams no longer are what they want. I mean, that's what's happened here. Somebody has gone through a period of enlightenment and transformation, and now... They have done their inner work. They're listening to their inner guide. They planted the seeds a while ago, and now they are have really grown into something significant. Honesty. I can't always expect the truth from others but I can expect it from myself. That's a pretty good card, don't you think? Many people that are watching this have, have become honest with themselves and you're receiving a new gift because of your honesty. And this is being honest with yourself. When you are honest with yourself, you are telling the universe that you believe, you have faith, you know, you know. You're, I mean, this is, these, these cards, they really fit. This is a hair font with honesty. I can expect it from myself. Your inner guide knows your truth. And when you can truly trust your inner guide and believe in yourself and follow your inner guide and let go of things that don't serve you, you will receive rewards. There is a new opportunity here for the people that do 
that are honest with themselves. If you are not honest with yourself, then this reading is not for you. For those of you that are, your ships are coming in. Okay? Your reward is here. And it's permanent. 